Well, it is called the Great Resignation, and it's even hitting here in Central Texas. Coming up, we talk with one man about why he decided to leave his job. Experts call it the Great Resignation. A lot of folks across the country are just quitting their jobs. The U.S. Labor Department says Americans quit their jobs at a record pace the last couple of months. 25 News reporter Jarrell Baker breaks down what's happening here in Central Texas. Chris Abels called it quits at his building supply job two weeks ago. I left because me and my wife had our daughter and my wife didn't go back to work. And so we kind of decided that we were going to do something that I knew I could make supplement her income. While his wife stayed home to take care of their newborn, the two decided to start an interior construction business soon after seeing a job posting on Facebook for a subcontractor to do interior work. I said, I've got all the connections and I know everybody that can do the work. Abel's accepted two bids for two jobs and got them done. Since then, he's hired two workers and hasn't looked back. Me and my wife decided, hey, let's do it. Take a leap of faith and get after it. He's hardly the first person to quit this year. In fact, the U.S. Labor Department announced last week that 3% of the nation's workforce, 4.4 million people, quit their jobs in September. That's higher than the 4.3 million in August and far above the pre-pandemic level of 3.6 million. There's a fair number of people who are doing side gigs and because they can balance their lives and they can set their own time schedules and they can work remotely. There's a big battle about minimum wage and what people should be making. Um, and finally, people are just kind of making, taking matters into their own hands. Financial experts say the pandemic allowed people to explore higher paying jobs and new avenues of income. And some, like Abel's, are finding success. I get to hang out with my daughter every night. I get to you know, have supper with my family. It's it's freedom, and that that's the best part of the whole deal. Now employers are trying to find ways to keep workers, like offering incentives and more flexibility. In Bell County, Jarrell Baker, 25 News.